We just had two papers that came out on uh, hagfish slime and how it works. The slime is made within numerous slime glands that cover most of the animal's body. And there's a, a glandular fluid that is produced within the slime glands. And when the, the hagfish is disturbed, this fluid is squeezed out of the glands and interacts with seawater to form this bizarre material that we call hagfish slime. The slime is composed of two different components. So there's a, a mucus component, and that's why we call it slime. Um, but what really makes it unique is that it also has a fibrous component. And these two things act synergistically, uh, and they, they interact when the slime is released and when it mixes with seawater to form the final slime. But the fibers themselves uh, are very interesting, and um, when they interact with seawater, they get stretched. And when they get stretched, they get transformed into fibers that are very much like spider silk. Um, so we actually we have a project going on in parallel that is exploring this the potential of making silk-like fibers from hagfish slime proteins. Mm -hmm.